morning people on this lovely, it's a nice, bright, but bracing, I think that's a good word for it, um, November morning. It's uh, quite dry today actually, it's been dry for a few days so it's um, very cold. Yes, definitely very cold. That's five, six degrees, I reckon. But out in the sun, it's going to help. But there's some shade on the field, and that's going to make it really cold. The northerly wind blowing you can hear. So plenty of coffee this morning. Uh, I'm back on the field where I found the gypsy harp. Not gypsy harp, Jewish harp, even. Um, look at other bits. It's a rough cloud field. The 13 inch cord on for now. Uh, I'll update you on the settings, they haven't changed since my last video. Or the orchard video. Um, I'm back out here because I just fancy a change of scenery. I could go back on one medieval field and um, possibly find a hammered, but I like to change, change fields where I can. I don't like to go and do the same thing. And I don't want to hunt it out because it's one of my favourite places to go. So I'd rather. Just do it periodically. I might even wait for him to plough it, but I'm going to go on here. I know there was possibly an aircraft part that I need to get ID'd, so I'm going to see if I can find any more aircraft bits, or if they were V1 or V2 rocket parts. And they weren't sure at the museum I went to, uh, but they said by all means bring them in, so I'm going to see if I can find any more. I know roughly where it is, but rather than stand here and get cold, let's go and get muddy in a field. And uh, I'll update you when I've got something to update you with. I'll see you in a bit. Right, quick look at the settings. There's my tone settings. Uh, where are we? Audio response is uh, normal. Recovery is deep. I've got it on ferrous. And again, there's my noise setting. The only I just put some eye mask on because I had a dodgy signal. Uh, I'll show you, I just dug three signals. Uh, sensitivity is up to 20. Uh, just because it's quite, as you can see, bumpy bumpy. Um, and you can't get quite flat to the floor. Other than that, and it's on deep as well, not fast. Sorry. Uh, my three signals so far. Top of a spoon. Uh, that looks modern, that was a copper signal, I thought it was going to be a coin actually. Uh, that's modern, nothing nothing to report there, that won't go in the edit. And uh, yeah, just a bit of tip. So I did, I did dig that one, I did do it live and it was, um, yeah it won't go in the edit, it turned out to be that. So, yeah, let's carry on, it's uh, mightily cold, too, too cold to be sitting around uh, talking. As you can hear, it's a bit skippy, but it's a definitely diggable signal. Uh, where are we? We're down in the... Oh, it's gone again. Bottom corner. Put the numbers on for anyone that wants numbers. It's not bad. It's that 12 here. It's jumping, so what I would do... I will just pop you down. Come back to you in a minute and I'll dig it live. cross <laughs> I've only been here 15 minutes oh wow I've never found a hammer on this field never ever ever I reckon that's gonna be an Edward yeah that my friends in the lovely morning sun is a hammered Edward. 
I do believe. You see his curly hair. Long cross. 15 minutes. It's not nearly a record. I think uh, 10 minutes was my record at Hammond. That's uh, three targets in. Oh, I don't want this to be my best find now. Otherwise, I'm just going to spend the morning walking around in the cold. Brilliant. Oh, well happy. Could have been a different, different, different Hammond, but I'm still not. I'm not complaining. Don't get me wrong. Hammond to Hammond, but do get a few of these. Depending on the mint, of course, because that could be a different mint. I've got, I've got Durham, Canterbury, Bury St Edmunds. Oh, I've got another one as well. So hopefully this is just a different mint, but absolutely brilliant. Right, I'm going to carry on walking, look for some plain bits. We have a coin on the surface. Just in there. Cool. It is so cold today. Should we see what the coin is? Ooh. I don't think we're going to see what the coin is, but you never know. It looks ruined. Beyond all recognisable. Uh, yeah. Um, I don't know if it was a penny. It's almost the right size for a penny. It's quite thin. Yeah, I doubt I'll get an idea on that until I clean it later. Even then, debatable. Right, let's carry on. I'm still buzzing. Well, after absolutely tons of junk, I've got a musket ball. Not normally happy to see these things, but you know, after digging tons of bits, I'm just scrap rubbish. There you go, just got it out of the way anyway. One musket ball. Right, next up, I've got no idea on age on this. It's uh, yeah, it's a funny one. Can't tell if it's modern or old. I'm going with old actually. Just for the way it's made on that buckle end. But that's very delicate, that's going to fall apart if I fell with it. Cool. I think I've got to wait till January till I see my flow, but I'll be bringing that one. Just for the fact it's more intact than most, and it does look like it's got age. So I don't want to break it, so I'm going to have to put it in my wallet, I think. Right, let's carry on. This looks just like the hammer that just had the uh, just had, hammer that I had at the start of the morning. As you can tell, my battery is going down. But it's jumping. A lot of the signals appear to be out of the wind, jumping uh, because it's so high up over these big bumps. But as you go, that signal I've had trouble locating. That's right in a good spot on the. Screen. But that jumps, yeah, look at that, it's jumping around the place. But let's have another go at a live one. I'll just set you up and I will be back to dig it. I've got to get my spade and my glove. It's blowing away. that. I'm not wiping that. Can you see that? Where are we on the screen? That is tiny. Oh look at let me just pick you up. I thought that was a button again. 
got a few buttons, not many. Like that, is that Saxon? Whoa, wait a minute. Right, uh, I've got a little bit of water with me. We're going to give it a wipe. What? Oh. Let's get some focus on this. Look at that, I've just given it a wash. Look at that! That is stunning! So small! Look at this side though. Still got some dirt in it, but look at that! Oh, is this one, is this, could it be a skeet? I don't know. It's got to be Saxon. I've had a skeet and I've had a Saxon era. 16, 600s. The gold coin. Oh my god. I've had nothing but rubbish for ages. Oh, look at that. I don't do hammer dances, but you know, this does require a dance, but you're not going to get one. Look at that. <laughs> Stunning stuff. It's about lunchtime. I'm just going back to have some lunch. Oh, right. I'm going to hang around here. I'm going to have some lunch and come back. signal was really ropey. Look at that, 10 p It's a 1992 10 p Look at the state of that. Our coins are not going to last in the ground at all. So this hobby will die out in a hundred years. Probably even 50 years, there'll be nothing to find. That's great, that's awful that is. I've just found a coin that's probably over a thousand years old. And I get a coin that's not even 20 years old. Look at it. Right, let's carry on. Well, it's been about half an hour without a decent signal. It's getting very bleak. So, almost time to go home, I think. Quit while you're a little way ahead. But I thought I'd see what this is. It was a, it was a good signal. Uh, oh, there you go. Not even I know. It looks like a little tin hat. Oh, well, if that's the top of the salt or pepper salad, you get a lot of salt and pepper on your dinner. Mm, yeah, it's one of them. Don't know what that is. I wouldn't say it's uh, horrendously old, but there you go. If anyone knows, let me know. Thank you. Right, let's carry on. Right, I've given up a lot of things today. I've done a few. I've made one successful. And every time I decide to do one, they're rubbish. But I should have done one now, because this one's quite good by the looks of it. So I think, see if it's going to be a token or a bag seal. Uh, pretty sure it's lead. It's kind of like a white colour. Uh, that side, there's a cross. Just about make it out. There's a cross on there. So yeah, I don't know. But if I found something, it's gone very quiet. But I'm on my way back to go home and uh, do a little roundup. Not that there's a great deal of interesting stuff, but then hell of a lot of trash today but you got to dig it to find this sort of thing right right excuse the wind this will be my last live dig for the day I don't know how many I've done now but it's this one sounds better than some but still no guarantee that it's going to be any good so let's have a go Get it? Something out the hole over here, can't see it now. Oh, what's that? Is that a button or is it a... Please be something good. Oh, maybe. I wonder. Is that going to be a Roman coin? I think that's a Roman coin. It is, I think it is. I don't get many Roman coins. I think that's Shrewbrinous guns going off in there. If you can hear that, that is loud. That is a Roman coin. Now, is it going to be a good one? Because I've not had any good ones. Never get a good Roman coin. Mine are always crusty. At last! 
<laughs> a half decent Roman coin. Ooh. I think some soldiers on the back there. Oh, bring it up. Soldiers on the back. I can actually make out a head. Where is he? Looking to the left. No, sorry. Looking to the right, even. Cool. Right, I'll see if I can find out what that is. A few signals today, but they've been good signals. I mean, good targets, even. Not good signals, because there's been some terrible stuff dug up, but... Oh, brilliant. Well happy now. Right, that's my day done. That is the monster pile of rubbish. Hundreds of signals there. Shotgun ends, spoon, wrinkles, you name it. Molten aluminium, everything. This is, there's not many finds really. Um, I mean, I've been here a good few hours. About four hours. Um, couple of musket balls, that weird thing. Uh, one lead token. Not sure what that was. Probably nothing. That's just junky lead. That's probably a penny. Don't know yet. That's the 10p. A button. And then the stunning stuff. That. Oh, it's not going to focus. I'm losing light. It's getting dark. Um, yeah. One Saxon. I think it's a skeet. I think it's a silver skeet. That's a coin and a half, that is. So nice. Very similar to my gold one I found. The Tremis. Probably a similar age. Uh, might get that ID'd by the end of the today. Posted some pictures already online, so if it does it will come up in the bottom. One Roman coin. He should be fairly easy to ID. Cut the soldiers on the back. And a little hammy. Uh, yeah, Edward. About 1300 is that one. Just about to see his face there. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Well happy. So I'm going to be back on this field uh, next week. It's a weird field. Lots of lots of signals, but not not too much great stuff to dig. But when it is good, it's good. Look at that. Never had, I've never had anything similar to that come up on the field. Um, never had a hammered. Never had a Roman item. Not had a Saxon item. I've had stuff in a field close by that I do, but not in this one. Didn't find any plain bits though. But there you go. I wasn't really, really hunting for them, but if I come across them, but no, I didn't. I don't know where that lot went. Um, pictures of this lot will be on Facebook as usual. Um, yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all very soon.